Hey everyone, it's Steve from B&H Photo. We're here at NAB in 2015 with Paul Isaacs of Sound Devices. And we're talking about the PIX-E, which is a video devices brand. Branded product, yes, exactly. So this is now five inch 4K monitor it's recorder. It's the world's smallest 4K recording monitor, yes. It's beautiful, and it has features you come monitoring, features you come to expect from yep. the sound devices brand. A full brand. suite, waveform monitors, histograms, vector scopes, false colors. People. But you were telling me this thing about TapZoom. Yeah, so TapZoom is really cool. It's perfect for the ACs. If they want to um, go to a point of interest like uh, here, we can just tap to it and then tap out. And I can drag. Yep, so it, when you're zoomed in, I can drag from side to side to go to find you in the point of interest and then it's zoom out again so yeah it's a very fast method for adjusting focus everybody wants to know about this guy <laughs> so and what i find thrilling i mean this is great but if we turn it around we see we've got two battery slots that's it l mount battery slots seamless switch over of power if, if one should die it will seamlessly switch over there's also an external dc port but the the media Okay, we call this the speed drive. Now, it looks for all intents and purposes like a standard thumb, USB 3 thumb drive, and it is that, but it's way, way more. Inside is an industry standard MSATA drive, which is available from anywhere, including like B&H Photo. And that's faster than Very USB fast. 3. So this enables us, when we slot this into the Pixie, like this, it automatically switches from USB 3 to a SATA interface, which enables us to record 4K and um, ProRes 4x4 XQ codec. Now I can get this empty from you and fill it with my own MSATA drive or you can fill it for me. Yes, we, we will pro be pro providing a 240 gigabyte option. So both there's two, the two options there, enclosure only or populated. And, and I don't need an extra reader, anything special. No. Well, this is just like a thumb drive. So record to it, pull it out straight into your computer. That's How fast fabulous. is that? And now we've got the, this is the 5, which has HDMI and SDI. Correct. There's another model, which is the E5H, which is HDMI only. Otherwise, it's exactly the same. But still do 4K because it's going over the yes. HDMI. Yes, so it's an ideal companion for A7S users, GH4 users, and what have you. What if I want something a little bit bigger? Well, we have that covered here as well with a, the Pix E7, a 7-inch monitor, which has a 1920 by... 1200 pixel and this display. Is, this is 1920 by 1080. 1080. Yeah, so super high resolution. They're very bright as well in um, 500 nits. Good in the sunlight. Yeah, perfect. And this also has dual HDSDI? Yeah, so dual link here. So this makes it compatible with cameras like the C300 Mark II that has dual link and we can achieve. So 4K over HDMI on yep. this or dual link SDI. Yes. And then we have the Pix LR. Right, yeah, this is an, an, an accessory which bolts onto any of the three models. It based, The primary feature is that we, it adds two sound devices calibre mic pre's um, with phantom, high-pass filters, limiters. But also we provide big transport controls, just screws onto the bottom. And a meter and gain control. Metering controls. and like, you've got these mini gain controls which re are recessible. So a really cool accessory. Really adds high quality sound to your recording. Well, this is sound devices. And what are we recording to? What's the codec? We can go any ProRes format from proxy all the way up to 4x4XQ. Paul, this sounds amazing and I'm thrilled and looking forward to getting my hands on one. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Bye bye.